Hey guys, uh, this is Max from uh, Century 21, the Harrelson Group uh, here in Myrtle Beach. And uh, I just want to tell you guys uh, one experience um, we had uh, recently, like uh, last week um, on Thursday. Today is uh, May um, 8, 2020. And I went a little earlier um, to a property to show it to my uh, um, buyer. And I showed up uh, earlier than I previewed uh, the home. It was a mobile home manufactured. I previewed it uh, before my buyer uh, uh, came over there. Then I walked around uh, outside, you know, inside the house. Then uh, I saw a, a lady, uh, the next door a neighbor, uh, walking out. And that's what I always do, even when my clients with me or when I'm alone. And I, I always try to get uh, the best, like a most, like a true information about the house, especially uh, if the house is in a, like a well-established, like an old uh, neighborhood and people have been there a long time. And I'm like, ma'am, this house was uh, sold in March for $70,000 and now they're asking for like a 139 dollars uh, they listed 139.9, then they lower to 135. In, inside looks really good, and you know, can you? Uh, and they done everything. They replaced like a floor, paint, appliances, everything. Inside look really good. Bathrooms, everything is good. I'm like, can you give me some information about this house? Then <laughs> we heard a lot of story, like a, you know, what's behind. The lot behind the house, all we saw was like a trees. We don't see anything else. And she says, there is a pond over there. And each time it rains, we get water all the way to uh, our uh, driveway, all the way to the road, pretty much. And each time, like a, we are getting really close or get flooded. So one bedroom at the back, she says, it's flooded. And on the, I mean, she was telling a lot of stories, like uh, yeah, each time, you know, I don't know, it was crazy. <laughs> and uh, what I was, I'm trying to say is, uh, when you go look at property, and uh, you don't need to be shy, always talk to a, a neighbor, if, if you see it, or take your time, even if you want to wait, you know, okay, not too long, not two hours, but uh, just try to meet somebody who lives right there. So they know their neighbors, they know uh, how they took care of the place and they know the house. I'm pretty sure they tell them what happened and or they saw it. So it's, you know, this house is very expensive investment of yours. So you need to be careful when you spend it. So if you buy and it's too late, you know, what you're going to do? And, uh, and the agent, they're supposed to be honest and they had to disclose everything, but they can say, oh, my seller did not say that, or like, they, they did not uh, disclose. Or in our case, the, uh, the, the seller was an investor. You know, he flipped, he spent, I mean, he paid $70,000 and fixed, like a title sell for double. And he can say, I am investor, I'm not, uh, you know, I don't want, you know, I can't, I don't know anything what happened. They just, they just, you know, lie, all that, all that stuff. So what I'm trying to say is get the uh, information from neighbors who knows the neighborhoods, especially if your agent smart enough to look at the sale history of the property. If you see it sold really, really cheap, now like a double the price they're asking, there is something fishy over there, you know. So you need to uh, pay attention. You don't need to be shy, you know. Just get the correct, right information from the neighbors. The neighbors know the most about the properties. And uh, that's about it. So sometimes, like some agents, they don't disclose, or the sellers, they don't, they don't disclose. So you just need to be uh, careful or be extra, you know, investigate in this case, let's say. I just want to uh, tell you guys about this.
But if you have any question or anything, uh, just give me a call um, anytime. It's, again, this is Max from Century 21 Harrelson. It's 843-957-7323. Thank you. You guys take care.